Hi everybody, Sergey Drachev here. Time for a quick update. Uh, I cannot believe YouTube. Remember my uh, last video where, uh, like the Sergey Drachev episode uh, one, where I was showing how to, uh, I was installing the tuner, and when I called the customer support, the guy put me on the on hold, right? And there was, I, I couldn't call it music, but there was something like a hold on music, right? Turns out someone someone owns it. And after I uploaded that uh, video, uh, YouTube posted a message on my channel saying that, oh, you violated the copyright. I couldn't believe it. So I had to uh, go back and uh, remove that violating song, which is basically what I was hearing uh, and you were hearing because my phone was on the speaker, speakerphone. So somebody's using copyrighted music on their on their uh, phone system uh, I wonder if those guys are paying and I went uh, there was nothing to do yesterday it was slow you know freight uh, slow week for, for freight everywhere so I I already was in the gold in gold in the old area of Cambridge I figured okay I'll go find another park so there's a park called uh, Riverside it's a pretty big park and it's right next to a river just between Kitchener and Cambridge so I went there and took some pictures and uh, uh, I have a small lens, right, 35 millimeters, so I cannot take pictures of something far away. And I come to the water and there's a little frog jumping from the bank in the water. And I guess that frog was uh, fascinated by all, by all this glass on the camera or something, but it allowed me to move the camera like this you know my lens can take pictures from about 12 inches you know so I switch it to live view and I moved it <laughs> because I don't have the articulated uh, screen right so and I, I needed to frame the camera so I switched to live view so you can see the picture from the back and I just moved it like this all the way to the frog which was sitting in these uh, pieces of you know some debris some wood over there in the water and I took a picture and the frog was just looking at me. Here's that pic. And then I was chasing some ducks. That uh, park is basically, there's a huge, you know, population of ducks or geese, whatever. And there's signs everywhere. It says, don't feed them. If you feed them, they will not fly away. They will stay here. Hey, we don't want that because <laughs> the entire field is covered in their waist you know i try to come closer to them and then i look at the ground jesus it's like basically shit everywhere you know and of course they were running away so i couldn't uh, i couldn't take a good picture and i went back to the hotel some some quality spent some uh, quality time on youtube but you know how many videos can you watch in one day like my head is already because there's nothing to do right so this morning I came to the truck, I was a bit concerned about the battery. If you remember it died uh, last time, but last time I left something on, right, the radio. Uh, now it started fine, it was sitting, what, like five days? I'll keep an eye on it, so I didn't change the batteries and now I'm past the warranty, but something happens down the road, I'll just get new batteries and I'll get uh, those that are, you know, like higher voltage, I mean, more amperes, better for a cold climate. I find that, you know, those are the best. And what else? And, and yeah, I took some pictures in front of my truck. I used this tripod that the GoPro sits now on and I put it on the back of this pickup truck. And so now I got some pictures that I, I uploaded to my uh, gallery and the link is going to be at the end of the video so if you guys want to print print my mug on a mug or on a t-shirt go ahead uh, so once again yeah the freight is slow I talked to my dispatch this morning send them a morning email hi morning oh it's slow and uh, some guy emailed me uh, a couple of days ago asking for a quote and that gave me an idea so now I want to put this message at the end you know if, if if some freight brokers or some shippers are watching and uh, you guys have some freight and you need a 55 ton low boy trailer to move freight between uh, US and Canada or be or inside Canada you know let me know and I'll pass this uh, info to my dispatch and uh, 
maybe we can make some money. Okay, so I'm Sergey Drachev. Thanks for watching. Be safe and be cool. Thank you.